my name is Isla Foxlin. I'm a mechatronics engineer turned YouTube content creator where I get to build all kinds of wacky fun things here in my garage. And like so many people, my journey into STEM began with small experiments in my backyard and it's blossomed into this career that I absolutely love. And so that's why I've teamed up with Arm & Hammer to show you guys a really fun little experiment to do at home and talk about a lot of my STEM firsts. All you'll need for this experiment is a couple small mouthed jars of vinegar. I've added food coloring just for a little bit of extra pizzazz, some balloons, and of course, some baking soda. But perhaps unsurprising for those of you who know me, my first chemical reaction was making a baking soda and vinegar rocket for my sixth grade science fair. I made a bunch of different food powered rockets and tested their efficiency, and that kind of kickstarted my interest in making things fly. And what I'm doing, by the way, is just filling each of the balloons with a little bit of baking soda so that I can get them onto the jars. My first impression of STEM was that it was this incredible superpower that gives everyday people the tools to change the world in both big and small ways. And the best part is anyone can be a STEM superhero because it's a skill you can build. So by starting small with Arm & Hammer baking soda and vinegar rockets in your backyard, you can work your way all the way up to orbital rockets or life-saving discoveries in medicine. What's funny is my first big challenge in STEM was actually just convincing myself to do it, to go to college for engineering. I was really into robotics in high school, but I didn't have a ton of role models who looked like me. And so when I initially applied to colleges, I was applying for like marketing and psychology instead of engineering, which is what I really wanted to do. There's a chance I'm gonna make a massive mess. <laughs> my first success was probably captaining my first robotics team to world championships uh, finals matches my senior year. And it was this huge ego boost that was really validating and it helped me decide that I could pursue engineering as a career. My first STEM job was as a mechanical engineering intern at iRobot the summer after my freshman year of college. I stood out as a candidate because I had so much hands-on experience outside the classroom, and so I was able to spend the whole interview talking about my projects. My first piece of advice I'd give anyone interested in STEM is to think of each failure as an opportunity to try a new take on a project. For example, if your baking soda and vinegar rocket doesn't take off, think of it as an opportunity to try different combinations of base and acid, or learn more about stoichiometry, or redesign your fins, or find a lighter bottle, or a whole plethora of other options. All right, safety glasses on. Let's try this. Please share your own STEM firsts down in the comments below or on social media using hashtag first STEM or hashtag more power to STEM. And be sure to tag Arm & Hammer. And don't forget to click the link in the bio or the button below for more STEM inspiration from Arm & Hammer baking soda.